All right, so the people over, so the people over at Titan Diamond Tools sent me something exciting. So I want this to be um, as real as, you know what, let me redo, let me show you guys. That was worth showing on camera. Look at this. I don't think I have another blade with a case like this. That's cool. Look at what's inside of here. So it's got the spindle to mount on a grinder, obviously. But this is a five inch, I believe this is vacuum brazed is what that's called, diamond hole saw. The thing that's cool about this, is this is a Schluter control valve waterproofing piece, which has a diameter of four and a half inches. So that's what that's for. So we're gonna do one take here. I've not used this, it's brand new. Let's see how it does. Got the DeWalt angle grinder. Give it a little test. Ooh, that's got some heft. All right, I don't have a, um, a lot of times you can make a little jig to secure your blade. I don't have one, so we're just gonna wing it like this. All right, that was crazy. I've never used a diamond hole saw that cut through that fast. That was wild. This is a beast of a blade. Because it's so, the di because the circumference is so large on this blade, like just think about how many more diamonds are on this thing compared to a smaller one. Obviously this has a very specific use for me, these things, but um, I am super impressed with how aggressive this thing was and how fast it just chewed through this porcelain. No water, no, um, no jig to hold the blade stable, just freehanding it like that. Uh, it's a little intimidating to use if you're not used to a blade this uh, hefty, but that's incredible. If you don't have one of these, if, if, this, if this little uh, review of this blade does not sell some of these for time and for a uh, for TDT, Titan Diamond Tools, then I don't know what will, because that was the first hole I've cut with this thing, and it just blew me away. Blew me away. Guess I'll show it to you guys. Look at that. Just ripped right through it. I'll do another one. Let me turn this fan on. Because that made so much dust. All right, so this will be Hole number two. Here we go. So much momentum, it takes it forever to slow down. It's a very solid blade for its size and heft. Look at that second hole, just rips right through. Well done. Titan Diamond Tools, well done. This is a great blade.